Want to know the best way to spend two days in Budapest? Let me show you. Hi, my name is Abby and I blog at Inside the Travel Lab. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to talk about Budapest, an amazing place that has tons of history, art, culture and food and most of its city centre is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. So join us. So Budapest, what an amazing city. It is created from two areas, Buda and Pest, and that's how I recommend you split up your first day. Spend the morning up in Castle Hill amongst those beautiful statues and then cross over, as we see in this video, to Pest. There's lots of shopping areas and arcades to walk around, as well as opera houses and, of course, your first taste of coffee and a chimney cake, which is a delicacy not to be missed. Budapest is a great place to just wander around and enjoy, but there are some sites and attractions that you really do want to see. I've written a whole list on my blog where you can download everything typed out. Make time for that. We're back up on Castle Hill here and heading out in a retro tour in a trabby. So history is impossible to escape in Budapest. It's part of one of its great riches. And the history is from behind the Iron Curtain during the Soviet era. There is World War II history and the Nazi occupation, and then Hungary as the capital of the Hungarian Kingdom and then the Austro-Hungarian Empire. The history really stretches back for thousands of years. And then you can let off steam in one of the ruined pubs, that's what we see here, which is a reinvention of a lot of the history that we see in Budapest today. This is us returning from the Stalin Museum in our trabbies and then getting ready for the highlight of any trip to Budapest, a cruise along the river. So on the mighty Danube River you can see the Parliament Buildings, one of the highlights of Budapest, the Chain Bridge, another super highlight. Budapest is really is one of the best cities in the world to see from the water and you can do a twilight cruise, afternoon cruise or do what we did and sign up for a 10 day cruise from here along Vienna on the Danube. So to recap, day one, the morning, Castle Hill, the afternoon in Pest, day two, either retrace history in the morning or relax in one of the city's thermal baths, then in the afternoon, take a tour out to see the Stalin monuments. Enjoy Budapest. It's a truly amazing city. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Do come back and join us again for more on travel around the world. My name's Abby and this is Inside the Travel Lab. Bye. Thank you.